Alright, let's get started. Today, my best friend and I decided to just go for a walk and still decided to go to our favorite cafe to have a very tasty meal. But to be honest, there are so many residents here that it's just awful. Hello, seller! Please sell us some tasty meat and some other food. Thank you very much. And as always, you cooked the most delicious meat. What when will we now go away and eat in this beautiful establishment? Then a beautiful table outside because there is no room at all inside. How great they cook here. It's just incredible. I'm so glad that we can eat very tasty food here. But it seems to me that we have already eaten enough. And therefore now, we can calmly go home to do some of our interesting things that we usually do. I think this is a good idea there already today. We have not had any adventures yet. I completely agree with you, we ate well. But to be honest, there were so many residents that it was uncomfortable to sit. And in general, they are everywhere. And there are a lot of them, and I'm already tired of it. It's good that at least we can sit quietly at home and no one will bother us and everything will be calm and there will be no residents there. It's so good that I want to take a break from them as soon as possible because there are too many of them in my life. Oh no, these residents are again near our house and there are a lot of them, eh? They're residents, you are already annoying us. I want you to leave our village altogether. I want to divide the village in half. You have already made me very angry. Now I will beat you all and destroy you because you are near our house every day. There are a lot of you and you are constantly making noise. How long can this go on? I don't like this at all anymore. Now I will take my pistols and kill you all. You are terrible and stupid residents who have tired me and from whom I cannot take a break anywhere. And even at home, everything will now be just a terrible action that I will do. I am already tired of this. Get the terrible residents that I have already gotten so tired of that I cannot live in peace. I'm so very nervous. We must now quickly go to the store with you and buy a special dividing line. On one half the residents will live, and on the other we will live. And then there will be peace for all sides. Hello, resident. Please sell us the necessary materials so that you can divide our village into two equal parts. We need a special red tape so that we can build everything there correctly so that everyone is happy with what we will do. Thank you very much. This is as always sold what is needed. And now we need to go about our business to divide our village in half. What do we need today will be with you. My friend, very good work, because we need to divide the whole village into equal parts so that the residents do not intersect with us and we do not intersect with the residents. And it seems to me that this will be just perfect. It has just been my dream all my life to divide our village in half so that I do not see the residents and was in complete silence. How good it is that today we will do this with you. It is just great what a well we will make for you so that there is... And we have residents because water. This is a necessary village and we will divide everything else. Finally, it will happen and we will live together in peace. How good the main thing now is to do everything correctly. So that there are no problems and no one wants to quarrel. Now, you and I will build this special red line that we cannot cross and the residents cannot cross. And then everything they will live as they want and no one will interfere with anyone. It's just wonderful how good it is that everything is going so well and everyone is happy with the results. How well and quickly we are building this line. It's really turning out great for us. How well and harmoniously we work because you and I are best friends. And now residents will not gather in our house. They will not make noise and interfere with us. It's just perfect. I've wanted this all my life. And now it finally happened. How cool it is that you and I have succeeded. And we are so cool, cool. It's just incredible. We made this giant line and now we can be calm and no one will cross over to our side and we will live peacefully and relax. It's just awesome. Excellent. You and I have finally built the rest of the line. Now we need to put a fence on that red line so that no one even thinks about crossing it and being on another territory. Now you and I will take this fence and put it along our entire village. More precisely, along its middle this fence so that no one wants to cross anywhere. And everyone will live great. How good it is that today was such an incredibly cool day when we decided to divide our village into equal parts. And now, no one will bother anyone. 
I am just making this line with such force and with such joy that you can't even believe it because it will protect us from these annoying and stupid residents who are constantly annoying. I hope they will not decide the rules of our agreement because if they even think about crossing this red line, I will immediately destroy them and there will not even be any space left of them because I am very angry. I am tired of constantly listening to millions of sounds of these terrible residents and under my house. And now I can finally live in silence. How good and cool it is when you can do all this so easily. Look, you and I, we have almost finished building everything and we deserve to rest. So I suggest we go home and have a good night's sleep because I am really tired after the work that you and I have done today. What a wonderful day it is today. And today it is completely quiet and there are absolutely no residents around. And I am honestly surprised that they decided not to break our rules. It is simply wonderful and excellent. Let's go with you now and swim in our cool pool which is located in the forest in complete silence without these terrible residents. How cool it is to be here when they are not there because it is completely quiet here and it is just so cool in our pool because today it is so hot. We can calmly swim in the pool. It is really cool and a lot of fun to spend time because I always dreamed of this so that it would look just the two of us together and having fun, I have already swum. So now I also suggest doing sports, because it is also very useful for us. We can run on a treadmill, lift weights or box a punching bag, which we will hang here with you recently. Today is just a perfect day. How cool it is to spend it, when there are no terrible residents around. It is simply the best day in my entire life. Complete silence. There are no very many people and only you and me having fun like the good old days. How good we had a rest! Oh no! Those horrible villagers came here again, and they all broke our agreement and crossed that line. Well, why did you ask for it yourself? Now, I will absolutely kill all of you because you broke our agreement. I will kill you all because we agreed. We did not come to your side and had a good time. And now you broke the agreement and came here. So now I will kill you all because you divided me very much. Take that horrible villagers. I will kill you all today and absolutely nothing will remain of you. All who broke the agreement and crossed the red line and started walking around our village. You are simply horrible and you yourselves can never negotiate about anything because you break absolutely all agreements. Take that horrible villagers. How cool I am. I hit you because I have a cool gun that shoots cool bullets. Please don't kill me. The villagers just crossed the red line to take all the treasures with emeralds that are on your side. They had no other options and that's why they crossed this line. It seems like your terrible residents couldn't calmly say that they want to take the treasures and had to cross this red line. Now we need to tell Mikey about everything so that we can find these treasures together. Hey Mikey, did you hear about some treasures that the residents want to find? Because they crossed the line because of this and I had to kill a couple of them. So let's find these treasures there now and then everything will be fine. Don't worry, I know where this treasure is. It's hidden in one of the caves and there are a lot of emeralds there. But I just thought that the residents don't know about it. But since they know, so that there won't be any more conflicts. Let me take you there now, and we'll take all the emeralds from there. Look, I told you there are a lot of emeralds here. We'll take them all now, and give them to those residents so that they don't get angry, and don't cross the red line anymore. So that you don't get angry, and then I think everything will be fine, and no one will quarrel with anyone. Here are the residents. Take all your emeralds and don't cross the red line anymore, and then we will live well and no one will attack anyone. It seems to me I explained it clearly, and now everything will be fine with everyone. How great that we resolved this conflict, and now no one will attack anyone. It's just wonderful. You know how good it is. Now you and I can sit at home and play computer games, but I feel like eating and all the food is with the residents. I have an idea. Let's offer them to return everything as it was and remove this terrible line and then it seems to me everything will remain and they will live well. Residents, I suggest that you remove this terrible red line and live like I did before, in friendship and harmony. 
the main thing is that you just don't make noise and don't walk near our house. You agree? Great. They agree. Now we can go home with you as quickly as possible, take all the necessary tools, break down this fence, this line, and live again as before, and everything will be just fine. How good it is! Honestly, yes, it was interesting to live with this line and it was calm, but still. I've already gotten used to our old village when residents walk everywhere, they tell something there, and do their various things. And how great it is that now everything has returned to how it was, and we can happily go about our business. It's just incredible. It's a crane that everything here will be like before. Now we need to work hard with you to destroy this terrible line that has caused so much trouble and behind which we all quarreled and started doing terrible things. And now we will live together again as friends and have fun. The main thing now is to work very hard to remove it as quickly as possible and so that nothing is left of it at all. I completely agree with you. Because honestly, without the residents, it's already somehow sad. And yet they try very hard when they earn a lot of food that we then eat with you. And now we need to be kinder to them with you. Because for some reason, we really became very angry and now everything will be as before. We will let our residents swim in our pool. They will give us food and everyone will get what they want. It will be just wonderful. Everything will return to how it was before. And our village will again be friendly and cheerful and no one will kill anyone and no one will do anything. How good that now you and I will destroy this terrible line and it will never appear in our village again. After all, we should not share. We should be together as one big team that protects our village from the attacks of terrible monsters and from all sorts of troubles. Yoo-hoo! You and I removed this terrible line and now our village is whole again and we will all live together and have fun! What about, let's go home with you because I'm so hungry and now the villagers have given us food. We will now eat all sorts of delicious buns that the villagers have prepared for us as a sign of our truce. And it's just wonderful. Look how many of them we have. And then we will play computer games and watch TV. Today is a great day.